Jelly Bean Story Page Bai Li and the Adventure of the Lost Tooth On a crisp morning, Bai Li, the young dragon, woke up with a peculiar sensation. Something felt different. As she yawned, stretching her emerald wings wide, she felt a strange looseness in her mouth. Curious, Bai Li ran to the shimmering waters of the mirror lake to check her reflection. There, wobbling at the front of her mouth, was her first loose tooth. Excitement filled her, but also a twinge of worry. She'd heard stories from the elder dragons about losing teeth, but none mentioned what happened next. Did she lose her fiery breath? Would she still be able to fly? Determined to find answers, Bai Li decided to embark on an adventure to the legendary Tooth Mountain, where the Tooth Keeper lived. The Tooth Keeper was said to hold the wisdom of every dragon's tooth and could help guide young dragons like Bai Li. With her tooth wiggling with every roar, Bai Li flew off. Her journey was not an easy one. First, she had to cross the Valley of Echoes, where every sound bounced back tenfold. As she flew over the valley, a gust of wind made her sneeze, and her sneeze echoed back at her louder and louder. The noise was so overwhelming, Bai Li almost dropped from the sky. But remembering her mission, she flapped harder and soared higher, leaving the noisy valley behind. Next, Bai Li encountered the Great Puzzle Bridge. Guarding the bridge was an ancient stone troll named Grumble. To cross, she had to solve a riddle. Little dragon, listen well, if you want to cross and break the spell, tell me, what gets wetter as it dries? Grumble's voice rumbled like thunder, Bai Li pondered. Her tooth wobbled again, distracting her thoughts. But then it came to her. A towel, she cried. Grumble smiled, revealing his own set of mismatched teeth and stepped aside. The bridge opened and Bai Li hurried across. As Bai Li reached the foot of Tooth Mountain, she found the climb ahead steep and covered in shimmering crystals. Each step was treacherous, but Bai Li's determination kept her going. Just as she neared the top, a sudden gust of wind swept down from the mountain peak, knocking her off balance. Her wings flared, trying to catch her fall, but in the chaos, her loose tooth finally popped out. The tooth fell, bouncing down the mountain and landing in a patch of golden flowers below. Bai Li gasped, chasing after it, her heart pounding. As she landed in the flower patch, she was surprised to find the toothkeeper himself, a gentle, wise old dragon with scales like silver moonlight, waiting for her, holding her tooth. Welcome, Bai Li, the toothkeeper said with a warm smile. I've been expecting you. Bai Li felt a wave of relief. What happens now? Will I lose my fire? My flight? The toothkeeper chuckled softly. Not at all, young one. Losing a tooth is part of growing, part of your journey. You'll get a new one, stronger and sharper, just as your fire and flight will only grow with you. Bai Li beamed with pride. The toothkeeper placed her tiny tooth in a golden pouch and handed it to her. Keep this as a reminder of your adventure. And remember, every dragon loses their teeth, but each one grows even stronger afterward. Bai Li flew home, her heart light, the golden pouch around her neck. She had faced her fears, solved riddles, and discovered that losing her first tooth was just the beginning of many more adventures. When she arrived back at the Mirror Lake, she smiled at her reflection, proud of her gap-toothed grin. And so, with her tooth safely in her pouch and the promise of more adventures to come, Bai Li drifted off to sleep, dreaming of the new journeys that awaited her. 4-0.